Hey guys, it's the Dark Jerry here. And if you ever wondered what it was like to be in space on Minecraft, well, I have, and I finally found a map for it. It's the Stranded in Space map by Jiggerbob. Of course, go figure, Jiggerbob, another one of my favorite map builders, just like Everbloom and all the rest. Anyhow, guys, if you're new to the channel, please remember to subscribe, smash that thumb till it is blue, and throw your bell at stuff so you can be notified. Anyhow, guys, let's flip around and get started. I love this map, by the way, guys. By the way, guys, you should totally check Jiggerbob out. He's got some great content and stuff on his channels and stuff. Constructing. Okay, so it says, test voice acting volume. You should hear a voice. If not, turn up your darn volume. Constructing. It should say that. <laughs> turn up your volume, jeez. In the far distant future of planet RS8, the planet's natural resources are running scarce. You and your friends are famed astronauts trained for a mission to seek out and colonize new worlds. Your ship, the Brightmoor, has launched from the Comstra Space Center along with an automated cargo transport towards the candidate world 312C. After eight weeks, you exit warp speed near your destination. As you pass J3325B, a tiny nearby planet on the way, a Ponetian ship warps in next to you. Their weapons are charged and the they do not look happy. Oh no. This is your story not the of survival. Don't hurt me. Those, grab those. Basically, what I want to do, guys, is grab as much as I can that is um, essentials. We'll want those, we'll want that, we'll want those, we'll want those, and those. We're not going to grab the actual potion tower. Let's see here. This is, I think, the galley and kitchen. So, we'll want to grab apples and bread. Alert. Ponition pirates warping into local space. Shields activated. We will attempt negotiation. Initiate code blue. Recommend gathering materials and preparing for conflict. Alright, so we gotta grab as much as we can before the shields get broke down. So I am on it, you guys. Wait a minute. Okay, that's not gonna work to open those. <sighs> Crud. I was hoping. Um, no buttons or levers. Okay, time to just grab something else. Beep. Warning. Negotiations have failed. We are under fire. Shields activated. Preservation team, move critical supplies to escape pods and prepare for launch. I just want to grab that. Um. Axe, shovel, pickaxe. We already got that. Um, I need to get downstairs. Bad. Okay, escape pods are that way. Warning. Wall. Shields at 75%. Breach on the upper deck. Ponitions have boarded. Preservation team launch escape pods with critical supplies. Escape pod direction holograms activated. Guess I better grab another brick. Ooh, might want to grab those. Okay. 
Warning. Shields at 50%. Bridge at port storage. More Ponitions have boarded. Evacuate immediately. Follow holograms to escape pods. Grabbing those. Wait, is that leather in there? Yes, it is. Oh, man. Oh, man, this is getting close, you guys. I hate this. That'll give me enough for a helmet. Oh, man, that's it. We're out of here. I think I've got enough now. Time to go. Critical. Wait. Shields at 25%. Breach at starboard storage. Oh, All crap. have boarded. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I get it. 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 I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Launching. Whew. Ew. So scary. Oh, my goodness, you guys. So scary. Oof. Oh, we hit the ground. Okay. Excellent. We do have a hoe in here and dirt and stuff. What's in the bottom hopper there? Ah! Okay, so we did get some good stuff, guys. That's my AI chip manual. So we got extra bread here. We didn't grab diddly dink for that, though. Um. So. But we did grab enough to make a base, which is totally perfect. Okay, so, let's go ahead and get ourselves a base belt, guys. We'll just attach it kind of to the escape pod. That was crazy, you guys. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness, that was nuts. They went after our ship real fast. Okay. Please give ourselves some kind of coverage. Okay, so I still got enough of these. Okay, yeah, I'm going to want to put the glass there. Because we did grab that one panel of glass. This gives us a window out that way. There we go. Okay. Oh, well, that's fine. It'll just become part of the roof. Okay, time to switch over to brick and cobblestone. There we go. Make a nice cobblestone pathway there. Okay, so now we have at least enough space to put down our equipment. And we grabbed wool, so we have that to make a bed. So let's go ahead and make ourselves a bed. We have a boat. I don't know what I actually needed the boat for, but we have it. Bit silly, but eh, whatever. Okay, so there's our respawn point and all that. Let's go ahead and take care of our first rest. Okay. Now, do I have any chests? No. So I'm going to have to gather those, but that's fine. Got pressure plates, axe, shovel. Nothing yet for a sword, but that's okay. We will take care of that as fast as we can. Otherwise, I think we've got everything set up here. You have landed on the small planet J3325b, not far from 312c. While there are no hostile life forms detected in the immediate vicinity, the atmosphere does support it. 
Okay. Moments before the ship exploded, I was able to teleport some local information here. The chest contains local flora and fauna information. I transcribed them onto ancient books just for fun. Please read as much or as little as you like. There we go. Now we got a chest for inside the base. This is going to be fun, you guys. I haven't gotten to play a space map in a long time, so it's really fun to do this. So now we have our first chest. We can finally get stuff put away. I guess we better make a roof, huh? Kind of the last thing we need is aliens coming on up in here. Okay, that gives us a good roof base. Alright, you guys. This is perfect. Let's go ahead and knock this one piece of nether brick back out. Okay. So we've got our base built, finally. That works. Let's go ahead and get stuff put away. We don't really need those right now. We can plant those on the next episode. We've got plenty of apples, so we got plenty of food. Oh, I have enough to make a helmet. So now I have some kind of equipment. Let's get that put away. Got plenty of food. We got potion supplies. I will need to grab regular cobblestone to make myself a potion stand, but that's no big deal. We've got plenty of pressure plates and materials. That's our AI chip manual. Okay. Alright. So now we can explore a bit more. Oh, we might want to... I think this is the um, activate teleporter button. Okay. Let's see here. We'll want that for inside the base. Oh, excellent. More good supplies. And another chest, so we can make it a large chest in the base. Epic. Epic, epic, epic. So let's see here, let's get this other chest down, then we can get everything else put away. We got plenty of seeds and stuff for food, we got plenty of bone meal, perfect you guys, great start, great, great start, okay. That lights up the inside of our base, okay so let's get over to the construction pad over here. This is an old construction pad. It will need to be cleared before use. I will hook into its systems for you. The space buggy is available to construct if you can clear the debris. This will give us our space buggy. I did not grab the key out of the crashing ship, but it's now laying over there. Debris pieces, on the small so. construction pad has been cleared. You may now build a space buggy by pressing the button. Constructing. Space you buggy. seem to be missing a key for the space buggy. I know I'm detecting one in a nearby now. pod. Try to retrieve it. I will in just a moment. I'm not in the mood to deal with that when I'm trying to clear out the giant construction pad. You can hear the motor of the space buggy running, even though it's just simulated sounds, it says. I went and looked it up. It's a simulated sound, it's really an electric motor. It's more for comfort and ease of the driver, I guess. So weird. So weird. 
Okay. You seem to be missing a key for the space I buggy. I know. I'm detecting one in a nearby pod. Retrieve it. Shush. I'm not retrieving it on your demand. I'll retrieve it when I'm good and ready. Sheesh. And now we know the real reason AIs don't have more control than they do. Those are Ponetians, by the way, guys. See them sitting there on the giant metal spiders. They're basically zombies with horse heads. It's pretty funny, actually. Alright. We've almost got this complete. Dude, no way. Get off me. Yeah, that's what I thought. The large construction pad has been cleared of debris. Okay, there it we is go. now active. You may build a spaceship when you have collected all the parts. You seem to be missing a key I for know. the space buggy. I'm detecting one in a nearby pod. It's Retrieve right it. Right here, I know. Sheesh. You talk too much. Darn it. Darn it. Okay, so now I have the key. But I don't give a rat's patook. I'm not in the mood to put up with that right To now. use space buggy, enter the vehicle, then hold the key in the ignition. Have the key in your hand, and the buggy will move forward. Exit the vehicle to stop. Or just take the key out of your hand, and it'll stop dead cold right where it is. Just saying. Oh, nice. More good supplies. And another chest. Alright, you guys, we are getting a bit close to the end of my capability, but that's fine. We've got stuff to finish up here. Okay, so now we've got a couple of good-sized chests, so we can take any and all food items out of here. And separate them. Let's see, is that all the food type items? Yes, okay. Construction materials, we've got a couple of fresh pickaxes, just in cases. Got a new fresh iron axe, which is good. We've got plenty of stuff here. In fact, we have enough right now to make a good sword. That's food item. That's the iron key, which we need for the buggy. Alright, you guys, we're doing good. Those can be cooked and eaten. Supposedly, they taste like feet. That's what it said in the book, anyways. Okay, so let's go ahead and make ourselves some... ...sword. So we actually have a weapon this time. Because that was really dumb that we didn't. The first time, now we can put those back. Go ahead and pop this open for food. As well as for potion items. Split those in half, and half again. We don't need that many apples, I don't think. And... Next time, guys, we'll go investigate the old spaceship over there. Anyhow, guys, please remember, if you are new to the channel, to subscribe. To smash that thumb till it is blue. And to throw your bell across the race and stuff, so that you can be notified. And also, go check out Tigger Models Maps, guys. They're awesome. Anyhow, guys, I love ya. Bye.